Early in the morning, the Pope entered the governmental house in Bangkok, where the Prime Minister General Prayuth chan -cha was waiting for him. He's the most powerful man in this country of 65 million inhabitants, with a minority of 390,000 Catholics. After receiving military honors, the Pope personally greeted the official Thai delegation. Next, they entered the spectacular building altogether, with windows that inspire Venetian facades. First, the Pope signed the Book of Honor. Then came the exchange of gifts. Pope Francis received a set of liturgical vestments embroidered in the country, while he handed the president a selection of his papal documents. Then the two leaders met behind closed doors. <laughs> After the meeting, they entered a large hall to give the first official speeches in front of representatives of society and various ambassadors. In his speech, Pope Francis recalled the word Thai means freedom. He said this is only obtained if people feel responsible for each other and overcome inequality. Specifically, he thanked them for their efforts against sex tourism. Pienso en todas aquellas mujeres y niños de nuestro tiempo que son particularmente vulnerados, violentados y expuestos a toda forma de explotación, esclavitud, violencia y abuso. Manifiesto mi reconocimiento al gobierno tailandés por sus esfuerzos para extirpar este flagelo. The Holy Father also mentioned the migrant crisis. He indirectly recalled that in the past, Thailand welcomed the Vietnamese, and now thousands of Rohingya arrive in the country from Myanmar. Upon conclusion, the president accompanied the Pope out. Interestingly, the women were dressed in yellow, and the men wore a tie of that color. In Thailand, yellow is a color dedicated to solemn occasions and an omen of good hope. For 15 years, we've been bringing you the latest news here from these streets. And we want to continue to grow and give you more services, but we can't do it without your help. That's why we want you to download and subscribe to Rome Reports Premium. It's an exclusive app that gives you content not found on our website. It's so easy to do. You just download the app from your smartphone in English or in Spanish. We want to continue to grow with you together so we can keep you informed from these streets here in Rome. Thank you so much for your support.